Hello guys, welcome to my channel Anti Confusion. So today we will learn about how to install Asterisk. So let's begin. Before doing anything, first of all we have to install few dependencies which are required by Asterisk. So I'm copying these dependencies and I'm going to install it. As you can see, I already have installed it. So it will not ins get installed again. Now we will move to asterisk.org. From there, we will navigate to download section and we'll search for all asterisk versions tab. Here it is, all asterisk versions. You can choose any asterisk version which you want to install. Here I will choose asterisk 13 certified version. Certified versions are much more better than other versions. So I'll copy link location. And now do remember that we have to install asterisk inside user src folder. So first navigate to that. Now to wget and paste that copied link. It will take few time, so I'm going to pause the video to continue. Okay, our asterisk is now downloaded. So let's unpack it by using tar tar zx bf and ast pressing then tab tab will give the suggestion and then we will press enter this will unpack asterisk and yes you can down get this document from my github profile so continuing we will do we will firstly navigate to asterisk then dot slash on eager after doing dot slash configure if you will see the big asterisk symbol then only your asterisk is successfully installed else it will not as you can see here my asterisk is not installed successfully so i will show you that it's showing lib jensen development package is missing so i have to download that package also let's download that package for that move one folder back and here i will write apt get lib gen DV sorry happy to get install yes now lib jensen package is installed we will again move to asterisk directory and do dot slash on fake let's see whether it will get installed successfully or not okay here lib xml2 is also missing so let's install that also apt install Lib XML2 package is also installed now. Let's move up asterisk and do dot slash configure. No need to panic for the missing packages because it will, all, it will automatically give you a suggestion.
I think it will get installed now successfully. If it shows big asterisk symbol, then we are successfully installed asterisk. Okay, I will pause the video or I should not pause the video as you will think that here, here you can see the big asterisk symbol. So now we have successfully installed asterisk. But few more steps we have to perform like make menu config. It will show you the menu from where you can choose different. Okay. What happened? Okay, okay. It's saying that I have small size of my terminal. I have to increase it. Wait. Okay. Let's make that a step again. Make menu on fill. You can see many modules here. You can choose whatever you want to install, but now we will just save and exit. This step is necessary for, to perform. Other step we will do is make. This will install all the modules which were selected by using make menu config. It will take quite long time so it took around five minutes to install all this now the other step as it is suggesting we have to do make install this install complete risk with its modules next step is examples we will create configuration files. Okay. So guys, if you think that this video is useful for you, then do like my video, subscribe my channel. Thank you. In our next video, I'll show you that how to create a user for asterisk. Okay. Thank you.